Hey, I got a really good question from Ron about the chord wheel. He asked, why do we always play in the key of E for guitar? Well, I can tell you why I do, Ron. Thanks for asking. Um, you've got your low E, which is basically the lowest note on a guitar in standard tuning. Then a high E, which is open. So you've got two E's right there, plus the B, which is a fifth of a... Uh, E chord or an E scale. Um, so those open strings give you that nice low sound, which is all you got to do is just hit that string and boom, you know, it just rings out. Well, I'm going to grab a guitar and plug it in while you think about that for just a second. <laughs> uh, wouldn't it be great if I knew how to edit video, but then I'd spend all day editing and I'd never, my content I think would slow down to maybe one video a month. So if you can bear with me doing it kind of cheap and down and dirty, I'll show you why key of E is the best. Well, for one thing, you can hit all six strings. Basically, you're an E minor scale here because E is a root, A is a fourth, D is a flatted seventh, G is a minor third, B is a fifth, and E is another root. So. You know, if you're if you've got some distortion going, let's find out. Let's say you're playing la. What am I looking for here? So notice the open strings. I'm just having a, a heck of a good time here. So I'm, I'm getting some open strings in there and here's some more. So I'm doing a pull off. To get that open string or like E you could do say like your low E let's add some reverb especially that E minor chord is so fun kind of hands-free. If it was in the key of F, I'd have to go... Oops. Whatever, you know, I couldn't play open. I'd have to be minding that first fret. So if key of F, you know, like for, for guitar players, like B flat, you know, let's say you're like me, you love that key of E, and suddenly they put some sheet music in front of your face that says B flat, you're like, what's that? <laughs> No more open strings, which is kind of cool. So B flat is a better key for horns. Just like we like E. Guitar players like E or G, which is about the same thing. Horn players, they like the key of B flat. Must be the way their horns are, are built. Or piano likes the key of C because all the white keys are just right in front of your face and that's a C major scale. Don't even have to dig into the black keys, which I can hardly play any piano, so anything on white keys is easier. So key of C for uh, piano. But remember relative. If I say E minor, it's almost the same thing as G major. The relative. minor scale is identical to a G major scale. And there's the modes that you mentioned, Ron. So here's an E minor scale, which is E, 
F sharp, E, F sharp, G, A, B, C, D, E. G major, which is G, A, B, C, D, E, F sharp, G. They are identical. Fascinating. Um, there's other, yeah, then the rest of the modes, I can come up with five other modes using the same notes to cover five other keys, five other scales. If you want to know what that would be like, uh, let's see if I can remember how to do it. Um, that'd be A Dorian, A, B, C, D, E, F sharp, G, A. Sounds like um, <laughs> Phrygian. Which is B, C, D, E, uh, F sharp, G, A, B. So that is B. Oh God, I already forgot. Mix, uh, Fr Phrygian. <laughs> And C, let's see what that is. That's probably Locrian. Yeah, C Locrian is C, D, E, F sharp, G, A, B, C. Mixolydian, which is D, E, F sharp, G, A, B, C, D. So I'm going to tell you the same letters every time. It's just going to be a different key. We're starting with a different root, but it's the same notes. But you just kind of uh, think of it. It's kind of a mental shift where I'm thinking, you know, you can say, hey, which mode is that? Like, uh, at some point, you just start, you just mush it all together and you don't even think about it. You just kind of play the sound you want. So it's kind of hard to get to get you guys to that point, of course. Yeah, Mixolydian is a cool one. I can describe it like this. Except you flat the seventh degree. Okay, we got any more? <laughs> well, looks like we got one based on E. Let's see what we get. Oh, we already did that. It's E minor. And that's that's uh, called Aeolian mode. Oh, there's one more. This is called. Oh, did I say? Ugh. I think I, I called the one Locrian when it was really Lydian, the F, F sharp. No, damn, <laughs> it was C, C was Lydian. Okay, the F sharp is Locrian, which is a really weird scale. It is uh, F sharp, G, A, B, C, D, E, F sharp. And this one does sound loco for sure. <laughs> over a chord like this, which is called F sharp minor 7 flat 5. That was 
that's right. So that does sound weird, doesn't it? just an E minor scale. As weird as it sounds, I'm just superimposing an E minor scale over other keys. So really, I'm just playing E minor here, but I'm thinking this chord. scales are relative and the, the easiest one to understand is like G to E minor like same thing just shifted to another root All right that's why we like the key of E and that's some uh, modes Kind of cool, aren't they?